whiteboard is visible yes sir right so as we were discussed in previous lecture uh, regarding shear flow and uh, shear center how will be the shear force in case of channel section and i section and we have cal uh, we have calculated the distance of shear center for channel section and for i section now the formula for the shear stress okay that is known to you shear stress that is tau is equal to as you know v a y bar by b i so if i am writing this v q divided by i into t right where v is nothing but your shear force acting on the cross section right q is equal to a y bar and b is replacing by thickness so this is general formula for the shear stress okay now how we have to find out the shear flow so right now shear flow that we have to find out right now shear flow it is equal to q small q is equal to right now vq divided by i hello shear flow that is given by the formula q is equal to vq divided by i that is in newton per meter shear flow q is equal to vq by i in newton per meter so where where v is shear force acting on the cross section v is the shear force acting on the cross section of it shall i press yes, yes sir okay then q is equal to a y bar and it is nothing but transfer shear which is having unit is meter cube or mm cube then i is nothing but moment of inertia i is nothing but moment of inertia which is in mm fourth or meter fourth right so this is the formula for the shear flow okay shall i clear this yes sir right now as we will discuss the shear flow in uh, i section and channel section so uh, once again i will uh, take some uh, sections 
you can draw and you can show the shear flow. So that Draw the eye section and show the shear flow. Shear force acting in this direction, that is suppose it is V. Next time if I take the box section, And again, I'm showing the shear flow in this. Again, it is two channel section. So if you cut from the middle, so it look like channel section. If you cut the, this box section, so it will look like channel section. This will be the shear flow in case of box section. If you cut in two part, then it look like channel section. So suppose the CG is here. CG is here for channel and for box section. So this is shear force V. These are the some cross sections where you can show the shear flow distribution. You can write shear flow distribution shall I proceed yes sir okay then suppose if you take the T section The shear flow will be like this, and shear force is acting in downward direction. V. Then channel section already we will discuss.
इस पॉइंट चैनल सेक्शन शेयर फोर्स वी नेक्स्ट वी विल टेक सर्कुलर सेक्शन Shear force. Shear flow will be like this. Okay, this is for circular section. Over. Shall I proceed? Yes, sir. Okay. Next, we will take inverted channel section. So how will be the shear flow? Shear force is acting. Shear force acting in the direction V. Then shear flow. This is for your inverter channel section. Okay, shall I proceed now? Next section.
audible? Yes, sir. Right. So this is the next section. Shear force, shear force acting like this. And last section, that is I section. Air flow is like this. Okay, so these are the some cross sections. Yes, sir. All right. So we will take the numerical. Remember one thing: the formula of the shear force, so shear flow, as we have discussed, shear flow, which is given by small q is equal to vq divided by i and q is equal to a y bar and you must know the moment of inertia for the various sections how to find out the moment of inertia in previous lecture i also inform you that please revise the cgmi chapter that we have studied at your ug level center of gravity and moment of inertia. How to find out the CG and moment of inertia? That must be known to all of you. So after that, we will find out the shear flow and we have to locate the shear center. Okay, remember this formula. Okay, that on numerical. Take the numerical. First numerical, find C 
shear flow Q acting on points A comma B comma C. The diagram is given that is box section. So from that we have to find out the shear flow at Q, sorry, shear flow is Q at A, B, C, at a point A, B, C. Find shear flow Q acting on points A, B, C. Okay, shall I proceed now? Yes, sir. Yes. Now the box section is given. Please draw the diagram. Neutral axis. Then point C is located here. Then point E is here. And point B. And uh, shear force is acting to the CG. V is given to fifty kilonewton. V is given two fifty kilonewton. So distances are now given. It is 10 mm, 140 mm, this is 140 mm, 10 mm, then it is 10 mm, 100 mm, this is 10 mm and this is your 40 mm. Okay, this is the box section given, rectangular box section. Shear force is given 250 kilonewton and the dimension of the Box section is given. We have to find out the shear flow Q acting at a point A, B, and C. Location of A is given. B and C is also given. Okay. You all of you drawn the diagram. Shall I proceed? Yes, sir. Right. Now, first step, solution. Step first, 
first we have to find out the moment of inertia okay moment of inertia for the given section moment of inertia i is equal to you can refer the diagram now i will not draw the again the diagram so is equal to bd cube by 12 bd cube by 12 so rectangle so 1 by 12 120 into 300 cube minus 1 by 12 100 into 280 cube is it correct big rectangle minus small rectangle so how much it is please give me the answer How much it is? Please do the calculation and please give me an answer. Eight point seven zero six into ten raised to six. Eight point seven or eighty seven. Eight point seven into ten raised to six. Six or seven then? Ten raised to. Ten raised to six. I mean, check the cross check. Do the cross check. Cross check. Cross check. Eighty seven. I get eight point. I check. other please do the calculation please check the value 8.7 8.7 i correct eh? 8.706 into 10 raised to 6 6 or 7 6 i have 1 minute ओके चलो प्रोसीड नो यस सर नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द शेयर फ्लो नेक्स्ट स्टेप नंबर 2 कैलकुलेट कैपिटल क्यू दैट इज ए वाई बार एट ए कॉमा बी कॉमा सी शेयर फ्लो चा फॉर्मूला माहित आहे मी सांगितलं होतं स्मॉल क्यू इज इक्वल टू व्ही क्यू बाय आय व्ही दिलेला आहे क्यू आणि आय कॅल्क्युलेट करायचे सो आय कॅल्क्युलेट केलं आता राहते फक्त तुमचं कॅपिटल क्यू सो कॅल्क्युलेट द कॅपिटल क्यू ऍट ए बी सी ओके बाय रेफरिंग रेफरिंग टू शेअर फ्लो डिस्ट्रीब्युशन Okay, we have to calculate the Q by referring the shear flow distribution. So for box section, I have shown the shear flow. So once again, I will draw the box. That will I will show the shear flow. is neutral axis so 
So it will be like two channel section. Then how will be the shear flow? like this please draw this is point a then here point b And here's point C. Of it run. Yes, sir. Okay. okay. So shear force will flow. Okay. Where it starts, that is, suppose you have taken the point A. From point A, it will start towards the left. Okay, so at that particular point, the so shear flow is equal to zero, right? Ja point person to the shear flow start with the Q Q value zero as it. And as flows, shear flows, okay, so Q gradually increase. Okay, why? Because Q is equal to capital Q. Sorry. VQ by I. So Q is equal to what is AY bar, right? So as the shear flows, Q gradually increase because Q, capital Q also goes on increasing, right? So remember this thing that whenever the shear flow start at that particular point, small Q is nothing but is equal to zero, right? Small Q is nothing but is equal to zero. So for this case, that is a uh, hello section. Now we will consider the value of capital Q. Okay. So write down. By referring. Shear flow distribution. Shear flow distribution. By referring shear flow distribution. Okay. So first, shear flows starts at A. So at that particular point, Capital Q A is equal to zero mm cube. Capital Q is nothing but A Y bar. The next second for B okay. B support. B supports the region starting from A. Starting from A, 
that is small q is equal to zero at a. Okay, from a to b. B supports the region starting from a to b. Okay, at a small q is equal to zero. Then third, for C, again C supports the region starting from A to the C. C supports the region. Starting from A, where K small q is equal to zero to C, starting from A to the C. So now we will find QB and QC, capital QB and QC, because capital Q is zero. So it is A by bar. So next line. Next line. Again, redraw the diagram. Now we will consider this region, that is point B is somewhere. So we will consider this portion. So this distance is nothing but I think it is 60, 120 by 2, 60. And vertical distance is your 10. And the total is your 280. If you consider this distance, is it correct? Why about one forty five? Yes, sir. One fifty by uh, one fifty minus five. 145. So it is simple now. QB is equal to formula is your AY bar. Q, Q is the formula same as AY bar. QB is equal to AY bar. So by considering this hashing portion area, 60 into 10, into y bar is 145. How much it is? MMQ. 87,000. 87,000. What do you say? If you have a share flow, capital Q value 0. B la point A person get A person. Origin is A, A person to me get lat, B parent. Statement upon diesel ahe. The B la getana A person hashing portion get lat as a value ahe, distance ahe, dimensions ahe. Okay, so Q is equal to A by bar, put the values and find out the Q. 
Q. Next. Now we will find out QC. Again, please draw the Okay, again draw the L rectangular section. This neutral axis point C is somewhere. So we will take this portion. So this distance is given. Okay, wait, wait. Forty mm is distance is given. So this is your 10 mm, this is 60, How much it will be? One hundred. Is it correct? Or one less number? Ah, then. Yes, sir. Ah, yes, sir. Yes. Right. Nantar itla zar tumi CG ke itla half half portion se parent. Sir, he kiti panna plus chais. Or one na? A panna se. वो तो हाजो में ब्लू कलर में जो बॉक्स के लेता था सीजी के तथा तेरा पन्ना से तो अने हर रातों का ही थी चाइस आज़र पकड़ लेते तो वाई बार इज़ इक्वल टू कितनी ओ सपोज सपोज वाई टू मंडल में नवद अने हाँ इतना जो सीजी पकड़ ला तो इतना हाथ समझो वाई वन होता जो आपने ला एक से पंच चाइस माइट है वाई वन बार वाई टू बार रिवेस केस में देखिए इतने ला वाई वन बार करंट दो ना इतना हैशिंग पोर्शन दो ना क्यू इज इक्वल टू ए वाई बार ए वन वाई वन बार प्लस ए टू वाई टू बार ऐसे ही बरोबर जाला डायग्राम जारी डायग्राम ड्रॉ के लिए लक्ष्य जाला सी परंत में गेटला सी फ्रॉम ए फ्रॉम ए टू सी तो वर्चर रेक्टेंगल हैशिंग के लाने खालसा राइल लग वर्टिकल रेक्टेंगल हैशिंग के लाने तो वर्चर रेक्टेंगल सेटी वाई वाई वन बार गेटला फ्रॉम न्यूट्रल एक्सिस अने जो खालसा जो एरिया तो माइट आसना रहेशिंग पोर्शन से तला मल्टीप्लाई बाय वाई वन बार अनि वाई टू बार आसे। ओके तो रहेगा क्यूसी इज़ इक्वल टू इट इज़ वेरी सिंपल ए वन वाई वन बार प्लस ए टू वाई टू बार
के इज इक्वल टू ए वन है सिक्सटीन टू टेन इंटू आई वन बारह है वन फोर्टी फाइव प्लस ए टू जो है तो टेन इंटू हंड्रेड है मल्टीप्लाई बाय वाई टू बारह है नाइंटी Do the calculation, please give me the answer of QC. Do the calculation, please give me the one of QC. How much it is? One seven seven triple zero. One seven seven triple zero. MMQ. Is it correct? All of you are done. Shall I proceed? Yes, sir. Right. Now, capital Q is known to you. That is for at point A, B, C. Now we will find out the shear flow, small Q. Next line, step number three. Calculate shear flow. small q for point a comma b comma c shear flow for a b c next line small q a is equal to v q by i is equal to two fifty kilonewton load is given shear force into ten days to three. You can refer the diagram. The for v q a is zero divided by eighty seven point zero six seven into ten days to six. So is equal to zero newton mm. Okay, right? Shall I proceed now? Shall I proceed? Yes, sir. Right. Now Q B is equal to V Q B by I. V is two fifty into ten days to three. Multiply by eighty seven thousand Q B. Divided by I is it is seven point zero six seven ten raised to six. Find out the value of Q B. Two forty nine point eighty one. Is it? Two forty nine point eighty one. Two forty nine point eighty one. Yes, Newton per mm. Okay. Next is QC. 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 Next is QC.